Uh, Rory, it's not always easy playing against a 10-man side for so long, but your players managed to see out the game reasonably well, albeit a few nervy moments at the end. Aye, but I think um, first half, even 11 v 11, we started the game absolutely brilliant. We were the team in the ascendancy and I thought for 45 minutes we completely dominated the game. Uh, should have went in more comfortable at half time and, um, and then w the home team comes out second half, crowd get up uh, and we allow them back in to a certain extent and, and Shane McElhinney makes a, a brilliant uh, goal line clearance with his head and, and, and we managed to see out the game but it should never have got to that point to be honest given our domination in the first half we, we, we should have put the game to bed. Yeah, the result leaves you second with bows on, with level bows on points and two, boi uh, two points behind Rovers. It's all very tight at the top, but it, that, that result must be a big psychological boost for your team. It's a brilliant one. Um, Daly Mount Park is a, a really difficult venue to come to. They've had a brilliant start of the season, uh, but we were confident coming here. It's been a good ground this over the years, and. Um, we're just delighted they, they go up the road with three points. Yeah, the games are coming thick and fast now. You have an inform Dundalk on Monday. Is it a matter of just gaining as many points as possible at this point? Absolutely. You can see how congested the league table is. You can see how uh, competitive it is. And, and there's always a result that people aren't expecting every single week. And, and um, everyone's capable of taking points off each other. So we just need to keep going, hang in there. We know we've got real quality coming back into the squad in and, and, and the next few weeks as well. So. Um, we're delighted with our recent form, uh, by the Shamrock Rovers game, we've been on a really good run and we just need to keep going. Yeah, it's great having such great uh, squad depth, especially being, on, being able to bring on players like Cameron Dummigan, especially with all the injuries you have at the moment as well. Uh, well, Dummigan's uh, missed the first 14 league games, um, he's missed a lot of pre-season, uh, it was great to get him back in training this week and, and, and get him onto the pitch, um, but for us they, they really kick on and go to the next level, the more players we have available to us the better. And, and uh, the players have been exceptional over recent weeks. We had to dig in last week, a draw in the second half, we had to dig in here in the second half. But I thought both first half performances were really good and we want to try and uh, do that over 90 minutes rather than 45. And, and when we do that, we'll, we'll, we'll go to the next step as a team. Okay, thanks very Thank much. Thank you very much.